Hey everybody, it's Saturday at the shore. I figured I'd, I wanted to give you guys a, a nice recipe today. We're gonna do a, a carbonada, okay? This is a very simple dish. It's not very complicated. Uh, it's delicious, it'll feed the whole family. And uh, so I put a little bit of a spin on it. I do my own little uh, carbonada and I really enjoy it. So I, I do it just a slightly different. So I'm gonna show you the ingredients real quick. So we started, um, I'm gonna do six eggs. We're gonna beat six eggs. I got the Parmesan cheese, okay? And then over here, you'll notice I have water and milk. So we're gonna add a third of a cup of water and a quarter cup of milk. So what the water is gonna do is give that egg some fluff. And you see the pasta's cooking. We got about a minute and 17 seconds for the pasta to be ready. So what I did here was I already made the sausage. And now, now, if you notice, I did the peas. We do a, a sausage and peas for our carbonara, where we're from. And uh, it has onions and garlic in it. So usually it does not have onion and garlic. I like to add the onion and garlic. So what we're going to do is uh, we're going to start off with, we're going to start off our uh, front flame here because we're going to have to get ready because the pasta is almost ready to go. And you're going to see how quick this goes. So we'll turn on this front flame here. There we go. Front flame's on. Now we're gonna take the peas that we sauteed. These are all pre-sauteed. It's salt, pepper, sauteed with onions, garlic, and peas. The sausage is just cooked sausage. Uh, it's Italian sweet sausage, cooked and, um, and chopped up into pieces. So we're gonna add that right to it. Okay. We're gonna come over here. We're gonna stir this pasta one more time. Because this pasta is going to be ready. You see the pasta is ready. We've got a pound and a half of pasta here. I'm going to shut that off. I'm going to hit the, what's this, off here. Okay, perfect. So now we got our peas and sausage in here. My sous chef, Santina, is going to uh, stir, uh, is going to drain my pasta real quick. Hello. And say hi, Maria. Hi. Okay. So now we're gonna go over to our eggs. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna beat our eggs. You're gonna add in a third of a cup of water, a quarter cup of milk. And you're gonna continue to beat. Now, we're gonna go get the salt. Get some salt here. Uh, let me see what a black pepper is. It's a black pepper, salt. So we're gonna do a little bit of salt. That's about a. I'm gonna use about almost a. I would say about a half a teaspoon of salt. That's all you're gonna need. The rest of the flavor is gonna come from all the other things that you made. When you saute those peas, you're gonna add salt and pepper to that as well. For, and while you're sauteing it. Fresh grated black pepper. Now we're gonna add our cheese. We're add our Parmesan cheese. Again, okay, you're gonna continue to mix. Let's add a little bit more Parmesan. So the Parmesan is really, what you're gonna do is add that really to flavor. Right now I added about, a, I would say about two thirds of a cup, uh, no, I'm sorry, about almost a half a cup of uh, Parmesan cheese here. There we go. Now we're definitely at a half a cup. Okay. What you're gonna do is, you got your pasta, right? And we're gonna strain that out real good. We're in tight quarters here. CT, you mind holding this real quick? Sure. Okay, so I'm gonna take the pasta, I'm gonna throw some pasta in. You're seeing it go in now. Okay. And 
see here. We're going to go about that much, I think. We're about good. Hold on. One more. I want to do this in sections, so that way you guys get a better view of how this goes. So I'm going to pull this back a little bit. Watch out. You're going to beam yourself in the face with that. Okay. So now the, uh, the sausage and the peas have been eaten. You see we got a nice mix here. Now we're going to add our sausage and peas first. Nice and hot. And like I say, you're going to do this in sections. You can do this in sections. We're down to shore. Our, my pots are not as big as the ones that I have at home. Okay. Say, so, yeah, give them a better look inside the pot. Let me take a look. Okay. Okay, you see that? All right, now we're going to go here. Now, we're going to take our egg mix. Show them the egg mix. There's cheese in there too, right? Yep, I gave them the ingredients already. All right. Sure, ready? Okay, we're going to add, start adding the egg mix into here. The flame's on, right? Now we're going to turn the flame on in a minute. So what you want to do is not turn the flame on immediately. You want to try to get this in there. So you want to try to get everything coated. If you tear, tear it on your flame immediately, what's going to happen is, is that you're going to cook all the egg at the bottom immediately. And you're not going to be able to get an even spread. So you want to try to get this everywhere. So we're going to get it everywhere. We're going to turn on our flame now. Oh, wrong one. Okay, we got the right one on now. And you can do this on high. You just have to be really fast about it and just keep spinning. And you're going to cook this egg mixture into it, and then you're going to see the consistency of it when we're done. And you just want to keep spinning it, okay? There we go. Can you see the consistency in there? Yeah. We're going to start seeing like the egg mixture starting to cook. Now we're going to keep flipping it. Keep flipping it. Don't worry, Santino. Santino's here. He doesn't like the pea mix, so I'm going to make his separate with just the sausage. There we go. You guys already got coffee? Yeah. There we go. I'm going to make this flip one more time. Now you see the consistency of it, okay? I want you to take a look. Now we're going to put this in a bowl. A nice serving bowl here. Okay. Okay. And that is your pasta carbonara with sausage and peas. So again, for your ingredients, you're gonna need, uh, you can get frozen peas. I recommend frozen peas over canned peas. Uh, but use frozen peas, uh, some onion and garlic to saute it. And then you're gonna wanna cook the sausage plain, just sweet Italian sausage, cook it by itself, chop it up real fine. And that way you have it ready. Then when you're ready to, when your pasta's finished cooking, you're gonna combine the, uh, the peas and the sausage. You're gonna have your egg mix. Your egg mix is gonna consist of six eggs, a half a cup of cheese, of grated cheese, a quarter cup of milk, and one third of a cup of water. And that's it, pasta carbonara. So I hope you guys all enjoy the video. Uh, remember, you can tune into the other ingredient, uh, other recipes on uh, Cooking with Cousin Pauly on YouTube. And uh, hit a like and uh, subscribe button if you could. I appreciate it. All right. I'll see you later. Take care. Have a great weekend, everybody.